Alright, hello, hello, here we are. We've got, uh, some stuff sitting here, and of course, Callahan, who's at level 27. stuff over here I'm going to be trying to work on. I figured it'd be nice to um, pick up a few more settlements along the way, make sure I've got my trade routes going right. Um, and then start the process of making my way down towards where the, um, the fort is that Garvey wants me to pick up. Should be good. Ooh, I'm also realizing I don't think. Okay, I don't think I've gone to the school. Did I actually go? Th I know I didn't actually go through there. Huh. I'm also realizing that even though I picked up this. better. Don't think I've cleared out the Slocum Joes yet. And I probably should. it out, clear it through, see what's what. Should be reasonable. Hmm. Eh. All right, Codsworth. Oh, more rounds. And Slocum Joe's office. Come on, Codsworth, you're right there. Codsworth is very good at getting right there in the way of what I'm That's doing. Hard to tell. People today no longer know the meaning of the word. What was that? The, the meaning of the word clean? Is that what you're gonna say, Codsworth? People don't know the meaning of the word clean? Sweet. Let's grab those. Oh, that reminds me, I've got a level up. I should actually take care of that. Improving to expert box. And, hey, that's an, only an advanced lock. Should be good. It. I want the recipe. Must have the Ooh, anything else? Dog tags, I don't really care about that. Dead guys. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, we should be good. We should be good. I have four followers. Of course, one of those followers is 
apparently myself. Because one must follow oneself. You cannot leave oneself behind. <sighs> Though, of course, many of us <laughs> are still trying to figure out of exactly who we are. Sir, this silence has been unsettling. Is it? I, I was talking, so I hadn't really noticed the silence, but now that you bring it to my attention, yes. It is disturbing. It's terrifying. I'm I, I'm going mad, Godworth. It's too quiet. What will we do? Oh, wait a minute, there's a school. Let's check out the school. Hmm. Uh, let's see. Oh, and there's birds watching us. Let me see. Oh, at the middle school. Malden Middle School. Okay. Oh my gosh. I am terrified of middle schoolers. I truly am. They're both awesome and terrifying. Hmm. And... Uh, and sometimes confusing. Hmm. Why, middle schoolers? Why must you be so confusing and terrifying all at the same time? <sighs> hmm. Be vigilant. Communism is coming. Oh boy. Alright. Well, let's go through and clear it out. See what we can do. Look at that logo. I usually see that uh, only where the gunners are. So that should tell me something. Vortex mm. certainly made some odd location choices. Although, in this case, they could be guarding the future. Hmm. What? Huh? <laughs> Bye, guy, you're gone. Oh, boom, boom, boom. boom. <laughs> You're done. Ba -bum -ba -dum -ba -dum. You're gone. You're gone. Yes, you're gone. Oh, and you! Explosion in the face! Oh, that had to hurt! Oh, 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 so much gore. Oh god, there's somebody else over there somewhere. that, there would be an elevator going down. You made it clear. Huh. Okay. Ammo. Mm. Cigarette cartons. Yuck. Don't smoke. Smoking's bad for you. I'm carrying too much. It's okay. Because I, I, I fully endorse the wonderful taste and flavor of cooked Soft shell meat. And, and, slightly, and on the side, a slightly braised, a death claw steak with just a hint of pepper. Alright, this is gonna be horrible, because this is a Vault Tech Vault. Oh boy, ah. Uh. Voltec is oh, is horrible. 
uh, for immediate release. Vault Tech to subsidize enrollment for Malden families. Uh, Washington, D.C. In response to growing national concern for the safety of our children in the event of a nuclear attack, Vault Tech officials have cooperated with local government in Malden, Massachusetts, to provide subsidized enrollment fees for any families wishing to sign up for a residency in Vault 75. The newly opened vault is attached directly to Malden's elementary school, ensuring a swift evacuation should an attack come during class time. Safeguarding the future has always been our priority, said a Vault Tech spokesman. The opening of Vault 75 gives us all extra peace of mind, knowing that the children of Malden will be safe, even if the worst comes to pass. Oh, that sounds so nice! Okay, their enrollment policy. This will be... Oh, boy. Uh, vault Tech has authorized uh, special discounts and subsidies for qualifying families. This special offer can only be extended to families meeting the following requirements. Now, the very fact that there's special discounts even and subsidies is a concern, because that means that the initial Vault Dwellers were actually paying on some level to go into these vaults, where they were often used as as guinea pigs in Vault Tech experiments. Oof. Alright. One or more enrolled family members are children under the age of 15. Enrolled children attend public school within the township of uh, Malden. Uh, the enrolled group includes no more than two adults per qualifying child. Please note that Vault 75 also permits the individual enrollment of children for families which cannot afford to also enroll a parent or a guardian. So, the children were subsidized, but the parents still had to pay full price, thus further encouraging only the ch only children there in the vault. Oh my gosh. Uh, spe this sounds like some Lord of the Flies thing. Special admission protocols. Upon activation of, se of Vault 75, all residents must be subjected to standard admission protocols details of which can be found in the Vault Tech Personnel Handbook. Once residents have been verified and sanitized, children under the age of 17 are to be taken to the atrium area, where they will meet with the overseer, who will provide orientation or information specific to the children. All other residents are to be taken to the holding area to await their briefing from the head of security. That sounds bad. And looks like they only noted the children. Ah, all right. Cool, cool, cool. Wow, they only record the children and none of the adults. Alright, this already bodes poorly for anyone. Uh, this already bodes, yeah, for, for the adults that set up their kids to come here. Ooh, wait a minute, Sunset Sarsaparilla? Oh my gosh, I need to grab that. Oh, but now, 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 wait, wait, wait. You, come back here. Yes, yes, Caldworth. Hey. Sir? Right. I need to, I'm carrying too much and... You can help. Yes, Codsworth. You are n you are much more than my pack mule, though, because you help in combat. You are my f you are my loyal robot friend. <laughs> robot friends for all forever. Yeah. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. I have to do something about that. And that and that's the for the right arm. Yes. Thank you for reminding me. Okay. And I'm being reassured that I am not the main culprit of internet usage, which is great because streaming here on uh, on Twitch is the equivalent uh, data usage of watching a video on YouTube. 
Hi, you two people. For when I eventually get around to putting this video up over there also. Alright. I just have to note to my friend on on Discord. Yay! I am not the main culprit. And then dancing emoji. Because why not? Dancing emojis are fun! <sighs> and I know one of you is going to go, at least one of you is, is going to facepalm and going, No! Not dancing emojis! Those are terrible! Alright, and I've got a mission that has just come up to explore Fault 75. I need to improve my stealth. Huh? There. Come on, come on, come on. They're right there. They haven't noticed me yet. Boom! Oh! Uh, a laundered, ooh, laundered pink dress. Codsworth. No. Grab Get anything that. useful. Ah. <sighs> now to be fair, Callahan does not wear dresses, but it's just—it's not his thing. Just because it's not his thing doesn't mean it can't be your things if you like dresses. It's just clothing. Uh, hmm. Try to be... Try to find a me means to be comfortable with oneself. Oh, wait a minute, there's a... Was there actually a computer in there? I was trying to read some of this... Nope, there was, but it doesn't work. Okay. And I can't use that door? Yeah, so... Quick save just in case. What the? Don't, don't, don't freeze! Don't freeze! It's freezing on me! No! Why? Why have you frozen on me? <sighs> okay, give me a moment. I will fix this. Ah, uh, crud.
Hello again. Yes, I'm back. I basically am resetting my resetting Fallout 4. <sighs> it's okay. We've got stuff going on. Won't be an issue. Yep, yep. I think I know it actually got it to freeze up, though, which isn't entirely surprising. I tried also activating a critical hit at the same time, and it just didn't want to cooperate. So, that was... I'm, fortunately, I fast-saved it just before that the freeze, which is great. It was almost like I was expecting it to do weird stuff once multiple opponents were actually up on the screen between fights. <laughs> <sighs> yep, 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 and we've got, of course, this beautiful music while it's loading. Hmm. Oh, oh boy, oh boy. Hmm. <laughs> More loading. So much loading. Hmm. Let's see. What is... What is this Twitch channel called? Let me pause this real fast for just a second while I, while that was coming up. Uh, eh, it's all good. <laughs> all right, here we go. Please work. Hey, you were in a different spot than you were before, and you're also dead. That helmet didn't save you. Oh. Okay. Anyone else in there? No, no. Alright, you're right here. You get a Molotov cocktail. Oof. Get some. Yeah. Volt Tech Security Hump. Alright. Oh, hello to you. How you doing? Oh, you've got that lovely, lovely pistol. It's okay, though. You're a little bit of difficulty seeing. It's right there. Makes it so much more painful. And yeah, yeah, I think your head exploded. That, that has to be unpleasant. Very imp very, very painful. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? You're over there. Oh, you're behind glass, where I can't actually get to you. As you're looking at me. Oh, your local stress. Oh, 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 boom. Let's, let, let, let's hit you in the arm. Let's hit you there, in that arm. Yes, break the arm. Oh. Yep, 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 here we go. Oh, you're right there. Hello to you. Oh, Molotov cocktails. No, I now feeling like I'm flaming hot. Yes. Oh, sorry, silly voices here. I do seem to enjoy my silly voices though, don't I? Oh, oh, oh. yeah, you're down, you're down, you're gone. And you! Oh, yep, yep, oh, look at you, you just like throwing that hot stuff at us, don't you? Oh, but. <sighs> Let's 
see. Let's grab a couple things. I think that cleared up opponents. Yeah, um, whoops. Quest-wise, let's, uh, eat some grilled rad roach. Tasty, tasty rad roach. Ooh, look at that fancy hairbrush. Alright, uh, this is clearly a room for small children, I'm guessing, from the toys and the teddy bears. And the, uh, am and the ammunition in the room, in the children's rooms. A a and the comfy pillow. We must claim the comfy pillow. Um, and that. Let's see. What's this actually say? Gary. Huh. G I don't know, was Gary a common name? Pretty new. All right. What else have we got? Um, burnt textbooks, Mentats, uh, some locked stuff. Always need more duct tape. Okay. Yes, in order to keep me away from the duct tape, because I clearly have an issue about collecting duct tape everywhere. Because you know, you know, you can make a boat out of duct tape. It may not be the best of boats, but you can make a boat out of duct tape. <sighs> All right, classroom terminal. Let's see what we've got here. Oh boy. Up Topland Heroes. Oh boy. Uh, there was once a little girl named Sue, and a little boy named Roy. Sue and Roy grew up in the very special place called Vault 75. They learned and trained and played there. Now, or how they trained! Sue and Roy were both growing up big and strong when one day Sue and Roy were asked to visit the Overseer. What's wrong, Overseer? asked Sue. Why are you why are you crying, Overseer? said Roy. It's just awful, cried the Overseer, wiping a tear from her eye. Have you children ever heard of Op Topland? Sue and Roy blinked and shook their heads. What's that, Overseer? they asked. Oh, it's a terrible place, began the Overseer, and she told the children about Op Topland. She told them about the people living there, and how they weren't safe or strong like the children of Vault 75. Monsters attacked them, and evil bandits stole their food, and it was no place for little children to grow up. No, not at all. Those poor people, exclaimed Sue. Why does nobody help them, wondered Roy. That's just it, children, the overseer told them. They need somebody big and strong to protect them. Who will help them, Sue and Roy asked. One day, children, you will, said the overseer. That's why you must do your best at classes and training every day, so you can grow up big and strong and go make Up Topland a happy and safe place for the poor people that live there. Sue and Roy smiled at that and ran off to their lessons, eager to help. Wow. All right, uh, today's lesson K-8 um, airs, all right. Uh, today's lesson's K-12s, or I me mean, T-12s. Nope. Okay. Today's lesson L thirty five question mark da uh, slash 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 dash Q eight etc. Definitely aired. Um. Wow. Up top land. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. That 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 sounds like some sort of uh, propaganda setup. Oof. But clearly, it's such a happy place. Up there. And there's an awful lot of uh, ammunition. Hey, Codsworth! Uh, grab anything useful. Of course, sir.
Take anything good. All right, much better. Ooh, camera. We all like our cameras. Ah, <sighs> yeah, let's put you away. I don't need the Molotov cocktails. I'm holding on to you. What other fun stuff do we have? Ooh. I like the clean- I like the tan suit over the black suit, to be fair. But, let's put the blue dress over there, and that, that... I'll do something with that shortly. Hmm. Yeah. Have your beans, sir? Okay. Looking at the rounds. There we go. Mm -hmm. Mm. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, pocket watch. Stim packs. More of that. We've got a sliding door. More going down. Wow. It should be okay, not an issue. Oh boy, easy does it. Moving over, do a quick save just in case. You! Yeah, it's almost like there's people over there. Oh boy! Oof! Ooh. Ow, that looks actually rather horrific. There's someone else in here. There you are! Anything but the mirrors? Nope. Hmm. All right. So. Hmm. Yeah. What am I actually noting? Uh, jogging tests. That's clearly endurance. Uh, radiation removal, maybe. More lockers. Lots of ammunition. Achoo! Excuse me. I didn't mean to sneeze in your ear. Let's see, we've got guns. Guns. So many guns. All right, let's sneak over there. Projections. Got a guy over here, maybe. He's probably upstairs. What have we got? What have we got? Uh, oh, he's got a really cool gun. Plasma 
and that, that, and I am taking your plasma rifle. Yes, I am taking your gosh darn plasma rifle of doom. Because, well, plasma is actually pretty cool. Oh, access card. I will claim that. Anything? Yeah. All right. That could be useful. Let's take a look. Move around. That's gonna be trash. Whoa. Huh. Well, that's gonna be trash. But as we come around, we can see there's a pile of things back over here, and yeah, kind of great. So maybe it's where maybe it's a place that the older kids hung out. Yes. We won't be stopped by a little thing like a lock, will we, sir? Hmm. Yeah. This could be where the older kids hung out. Would not be a surprise. So what have we got? So what do we got? We have a clear indication of some form of combat training taking place also. Weapons training. Uh, clear uh, that little that story clearly intended to encourage the kids to be big and strong to defend the people upstairs. We've got uh, endurance tests with that running, possibly. Hmm. Yeah. Right. One last check over here. We've got... This is clearly the shower area over here, which looks like it's the uh, unisex bathrooms as well. So the boys and girls had to share a uh, shower and toilet facilities. Hmm. And the reactor area also has a playground. Ooh. Okay. Wings and baseball. Yeah, definite playground and baseball. Diamonds. Patreon. Residential. But this is residential, and that also says. All right. So a room for the little kids. And. I don't know if they were splitting up the boys and girls, residentially speaking. They, they could have been. But the bathroom utility... But 
Shower facilities and such are clearly unisex. Hmm. clearly back to where I, I had been previously. Just the training area. Can't go in there yet, but... Or then. And this is clearly going up and around. Oh no, Grey Garden's got a thing. All right. I'm gonna have to hop over there after this. See if I've got enough time. Psycho, huh? That looks unpleasant. Um... And they've got some sleeping accommodations in here as well. Which are also very clearly unisex. watch the experiment as it takes place and watch the children while they're down here getting ready about to go out wow and watch the children while they're doing the exercises for the testing and watch the children while they're being tested for the radiation oh when they're just getting into the place. Oof. Wow. So lots of observation with the testing area, clearly. Um... Well, he certainly doesn't 
Hey. Grab that. Alright. Hmm. Hmm. <sighs> Got it. Paper, huh? Nothing in the lockers. Very unisex again. Hmm. Friend of pattern. An actual computer. Well, let's see what we got. This is the uh, chief scientists. Primary or uh, prime directive. This will be where it gets. Welcome to Vault 75. As outlined in your confidential briefing packet, Vault 75 is part of a top-secret military program. You have been selected for your professional credentials, experience, and commitment to the improvement of the human genome. It is of the utmost importance that you follow the protocols herein. The mission of Vault 75, above all, is the refinement of human genetics. Your scientific staff will operate according to the research schedule set forth by Scarlet, Braun, and Lamb. Or by, oh, by Schlett, Braun, and Lamb. You will be working with an overseer with a background as a military officer. Your overseer will be responsible for training and maintaining the subject population you will be working with. It is important that you and your overseer maintain a healthy working relationship. Ah, oh, gosh. Improving the human genome. Alright, that already sounds... bad. Uh, represents an... Okay, Vault 75 represents an unprecedented opportunity to test our hypothesis that the human genome can be improved by a, at a rapid rate through the combination of selective breeding, hormonal treatment, genetic modification, and an accelerated uh, generational cycle. Yep, I don't think I want to read more of that. Selective breeding. That's... Worth. Get that. Why don't you grab the rest? Check it out. And anything else? Hmm. Selective trading. Yuck. That's it. There we go. But we have Grog Knock. The Barbarian, uh, increasing my unarmed melee 
attack damage or critical hits by seventy or by five percent. Getting the key for the thing. Not oh, stim pack, good. Some soap. Get some rounds. Mentats. Yeah. Um. If you need to know, yes, the parents were killed. They killed the parents. It's in the journals. Garden that was calling for the help, I believe. Yes. So that should be my next stop. I thought I had explored the admin area. It's okay, I will have I'll simply come back once I finish with the Grey Garden stuff. I think I have to tap onto the computer, which is fine. Not an issue. I can easily go back, do that, grab some extra stuff along the way. <sighs> Find out just how bad that experiment was. Disable this arm, open door. Fast travel to Grey Garden, which is just right there. Oh, look at that! It's several raiders. Oh boy. rewarding the exploding corpses the cluster of bodies oh what what um let's see I need to 
Oh, there's this, this, this obnoxious quotes that I could utilize from, uh... From, yeah, from a certain Batman movie, with things that the Joker's saying. With, with Jack Nicholson as the Joker. Because, well... Oh... Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh, and there's a guy over here even, I hadn't even realized. Who also had a rocket launcher. And he was balding. Alright, uh, well, let's drop things off in here. Oh boy. Okay. And now that that's been taken care of and is finished, they're clearly happy. I was over here in Malden trying to finish clearing out Vault 75. Hmm. Had that one last item to check out. <sighs> hmm. Oh, why is it exploding? Why are you exploding? I just got here. What the heck? All right. Hmm. Someone beeped at me somewhere, maybe. I don't know. It's all good. Hmm. <sighs> it's all good. Nothing in the walls. Oh. Heading back downstairs. Ah. It's always fun when my Discord, or when my email also gives me tons of political stuff. <sighs> oh, if you, now, I know that some of you will be, end up asking, which party is the one that's sending me stuff? And, well, I'm going to disappoint you and say that it's both Republican and Democrat email that I receive. As, as the two both of the two major parties really seem to want me to choose their side of the equation. <laughs> oh, let's see. Alright.
All right. Hmm. Ah, and if you're going to be trying to get me to say which side I favor, you may be disappointed again. There are parts of the... there are elements of the Republican side, and there are elements of the Democrat side that I find reasonable. And then there's also parts that seem a bit... Mo I, I'm really... I am a moderate. It isn't necessarily one party or the other. I'm somewhere in between. I, I'm a moderate. Hmm. <sighs> Let's see what some good examples here. Hmm. Gun safety. I believe in gun safety. Now, does that mean that I... Now, by me saying I believe in gun safety, that does not mean that I am opposed to the right to bear arms. I just want to be... I just want to ensure that it is a safe methodology that goes along with it, where... That results in the fewest number of individuals b being at risk. <clears throat> now, uh, let's see. I see. Believe the goal is now to go. Am I heading up there? Maybe. Maybe. All right. Like, if you really, if you really wanted to be one of those people that owns, like, a, uh, high-powered, um, semi-automatic assault rifle, fine. I may, I may question what you want to use it for, but I'm not going to say you can't own it. And, and if you say it's for hunting, I am totally going to ask, are you really that bad of a shot? We're in trouble. I need you up and working, Codsworth. We've got robots attacking. Deadly, deadly robots. Oh, and raiders. Robots and raiders. Oh, they're, they're rust devils.
was scary for a moment there. Definitely scary there for a moment. Um. Hmm. Okay, if you're going to be doing this thing with the lagging bit, I'm going to pause, I'm going to make sure I've saved it just in case you're going to crash on me again, you silly game. Please, don't crash on me again. I don't really want to go down there yet, at least because, well, there's probably scary things down there. Like, like, I don't know, giant bugs. Giant bugs would be scary. Scary bugs. Mm. Thinking of that. Let's see how these folks are here doing. Green top. Anyone in here? No. You've got to help. Oh, they've hello? kidnapped my wife. They kidnapped your wife? All right, calm it's down. Okay. Tell me what happened. You just need to tell me what happened. They said they'd be back for the ransom in a few days. If I don't pay up, they'll kill her. But I don't have that kind of money. I'll help don't you worry. out. I'll get her back. Thank you. Thank you. I didn't know what I was going to do. Just bring her back safe, okay? All right, Backstreet Apparel is where I'm going. Let's activate that. Let's see. Backstreet Apparel's right there. I still have to set up and activate a recruiting thing there for Hangman's Alley. It's fine. I will get around to it. Hmm. I'm fairly close to the next level. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> so. Gun safety, though, where I was sort of ranting a little bit. Um, I've had an uncle who has shot himself in the foot twice because, well, he was sort of dumb with his guns. That's just as a place to start off with. He was... He was basically getting into his car with the guns, and he shot himself in the foot. Sweet. They were going to go camp... They were going to go f uh, hunting. He was clearly not safe with the guns. Like, why have the gun loaded when you're getting into the car before to actually drive? To where you're going to go hunting. That that doesn't.
I'd have, if I had a friend who also was showing off their gun and shot themselves in the foot. So, I, I've had examples of individuals who were not safe with how they handled their guns. Hmm. Please be safe with your guns, if you own a gun. If you don't own a gun, well, you are not required to <laughs> own one. You're not required to own one. But that's, that, it's still the be safe with, still try to be safe with them. got down. Yay. Okay. Backstreet Apparel should be over this way. Got it. And there. Oh boy. That was a good one. You have any more stories like that? How much time you got? <laughs> yeah, I have a few. Let me see. A couple years back, before I met Clutch, me and a couple friends found a young kid on the north side of the Charles. He wasn't that young, probably around 18 or so. Anyway, after hanging out with him for a while, it started to get dark, so I built a fire. I kid you not. As soon as I lit the first match, the kid screams, what are you doing? And knocks the match out of my hand. Hey. What the fuck was that? What is this? There you are. Got folks, we've got folks in there. Just get warmed up over here.
Yeah. If you're someone from outside the U.S. and uh, are questioning why I'm being having to be sort of like Pacific in the this is what I'm meaning when I say this. Well, apparently here in the United States, some people can be rather touchy when it comes to their right to bear arms, and anyone questioning any degree of it uh, is viewed as disrupting their 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 civil liberties, which is um honestly excessive in my I've viewpoint. Why? Yes, this will be different because you'll be dead. One in the face, two in the face, three in the face. And now you don't have a face. Your face is gone. But I yes. now have Grognak the Barbarian. And it's the uh, Lost in the Snows of Lust. Okay. Um I don't know. Th those um those two women look a bit uh, frigid. Almost like they're made out of snow. Um, Taking the brain out for a stroll. Let's see, let's get locksmithing at master level. Impact. We've, we've killed off the raiders that were in here. Let's see what we can do to get uh, this person out. Hello. Please, you've got to help me. Don't worry. Yeah. I'm here to rescue you. Oh my god. Thank you. Let's go. Good, good, good. Let me grab that too. Let's get out of here then. We cleared these folks up. Um, yeah, don't need that, I suppose. Oof. bit of a loading screen. Yep. Going through. Here we are. <clears throat> and let's get her back home. Which should be just over here. Green Top Nursery. And 
he should be over here for turning us in. Oh, I don't hello. Know thank you for that rescue you pulled off. Ah, it's all thanks Just to the Minutemen. This is all thanks to the Minutemen. Oh, we know. That's why we've decided to join the Minutemen. You can count on our help if you need it. Excellent. Now then. I want to get some defenses set up, but I need gears. Okay. First off, that and that scrap. Let's see what we have. stuff along the way. Gears I'm in need of, huh? Alright. Not a real problem. Well, maybe. Can't really do much about those. Neat is needed, but I will be upgrading that when I have a chance. Um, God's worth. Hey, sir. Ah. Ah, da, 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 da. All right, let's hop over here and see what we can do. Okay, you're Carla. Oh, wait a minute. Better make this a little bit easier. Alright. Ah! Good. I am going to move you, my good, dear friend, over to... Where are you? The boathouse. And then make you also be the connection to, to that. So that I can then hop over here to the boathouse. Which now has four people. Where, which I think you need an extra bed, I think. Hmm. Letting that process through a bit. Uh, no, no, I'm actually good bed. No, yeah, I am one bed short. So let's address that real fast. Hello, hello. You're here. Uh, bed. Hmm. Just like so. Oh, you're still locked, aren't you? Yes. Let's just nab all of that. Okay. How are we doing bed-wise now? Alright. And then move you up here. Yeah.
and I'm noting that you're basically living here in this shed with a... and... you know... Starters... Let, let, let's get some turrets set up over here just in case because this is often one of those sides there when the attack comes through. Just, just in case. Then... Let's see what we can do about this little bit of flooring here. wall there. See if we can give you a doorway. Also because, you know, you deserve to have privacy. And let's get this rather simple ceiling on here. needing this at some point. Let's get an extra bed in here just in case. And then... a door. That you haven't had before. Thank you, Codsworth. Yes. I've been spending a lot of time with him, haven't I? Now then... Ah. Alright, we've got a good basic start here. Mm. As well as extending out their, the shack that they're, that they're living in next to the dilapidated house. Ah. Alright. Well. Probably continue my way up north then. Oh, what are my stats sitting at? Oh, that was the hub flowers. Okay. Oh gosh. We've got two of those things. Are they no have they noticed me yet? Oh, there's three of them. Okay. Oof. Okay. 
that was um yeah comes around, it clearly partially goes that way, and part of it goes up this way. And then there's that tower over there. So let's head north. Hmm. A little bit of delay, momentary delay there, it's adjusting. Heading along. Probably something over that way. It's worth adjust it is worth going to. And there are a thing over that way. But let's go this route to address the uh, that Brotherhood of Steel quest line. There's cars, plural, stuck in, a tr stuck in trees. Who's there? We've got super mutants. Oh boy. Oh boy. Guys, guys. They went down so fast! If only they weren't actually carrying a uh, horrible and possibly dumb thing with them in the form of uh, a nuclear device that they were planning on slamming to the ground. Alright, so before I open that door, First things first, my special stat for Charisma is presently at a 7, so let's take a look at my apparel. Let's switch this over to a nice, clean, tan suit. <sighs> Which put me at a 9. And do I have anything? Oh! Anything that may help with Charisma. Take a look. That was perception, that's endurance and strength. Do 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 boom boom boom. That was perception, but gives me damage. Boom ba doom boom boom. Perception. Rad resistance. Nope. Alright. Well. Have to hope for the best. Doing a quick save. Open the door. I don't know I'll I don't know if I'll be able to actually convince him to come back. Let's see. Freeze. Wait, hello. One more step and I'll I'll blow your damn head off. Who are you? Who sent you? How did you get in here? Uh, the Brotherhood of Steel Easy, sent me. Paladin. I'm with the Brotherhood. The Brotherhood? No, 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 it can't be. They're, they're, they're too far away. They wouldn't send you, would they? Let's, uh, let's say I believe you. How did you find me? Uh, well, there was these distress signals. I followed signals. the distress beacons left by your team. Their hollow tapes led me here. The others? What, uh, what happened to them? I'm sorry, but they're, um, all dead. But here's they're the holo tags. I recovered their tags. You... you... you did? Thank you. This... this really means a lot to me. 
I tried to go back for them, you know. There was nothing I could do, not alone, but... But I'd hoped you'd been through a lot to find me. I should... I should give you something. I've collected a lot over the years. Technology, odds and ends. If, if you see anything you want, take it, take it. Uh, can you re- well, how about you rejoin the Brotherhood? The Brotherhood, Brotherhood needs you, Paladin. It's time you reported in. I, I, I can't. It's, it's been too long. I, I wouldn't be of any use. Come on. They could really use you. You're an expert no in the area. No one knows the Commonwealth better than you. We need your help. I've been here too long. I'm, I'm, I'm not myself. Would they still take me? The Brotherhood yes. will honor the memory of your team. Shouldn't you be the one to tell their story? Unless I go back there. Their sacrifices, everything we went through, it'll be forgotten. I can't let that happen. I'll do it. For them. All right, I'll, uh, I'll get my things together. Thank you. Thank you for everything. All right. Wait, we got, and that's the fusion core. Do do do. We've got stealth boy. We've got some ammo. There's a chest. There's his tape. Brotherhood of Steel Recon Team 429 Alpha. Final report. Our mission has failed. Six hours after insertion, my company was ambushed. We lost five knights and exhausted our power armor reserves. We scuttled the armor to prevent looting, and then retreated under fire, abandoning our supplies. I was separated from the two remaining members of my team within a week. Both are missing. Status unknown. I'd hoped to rendezvous with them at our holdout bunker and seek a means of escape from the Commonwealth. But no one has come. No one has come. And that... I just have to go and report that in. Top over. Mm. Yeah, this is going to go bad. I feel as if we're I'm just finally making progress, sir. Mr. Valentine seems to be quite the detective. Save that real fast. I need that, I think. Alright. 
because the uh, upping the damage to something else. Guys, all right, now I can save that and let's get the lake dinged as a location. Because, you know, one always needs tasty crab meat. Great for sandwiches. Or if you really like crab legs. Yep, yep. Some of you may be... Someone out there is going to go, Ah, no, not the crab leg things. It's fine. It may not be an ad from your... Uh, re from your region. That's it. It's part of the fun. Alright. Now then, how am I doing? There. And let's go and turn this ad in. Oh, I'm realizing I'm still wearing the suit. Ah! I should probably uh, switch back to my normal outfit. Yeah, yeah. Hmm? Uh, Tropia Top Gamer TTG is raiding with a party of four. Ah! That sounds pretty cool. Alright. Uh, inventory. Apparel. Just put that on. I believe there's that. And that. I think we've still got that. And what was my left leg? Oh, no, that's left leg. Alright. Oh gosh. I'm still using it for my... okay. My left arm is that I have to get to a different one. Alright. Because mm. all the fun stuff seems to be on my right arm, and I really... Hmm. all good. And You're back. Any word on the patrol? Uh, yes. Oh, and hello to my new follower. And let's see, let's turn in this I've report. I've completed my yes. investigation into the missing recon team. Paladin Brandis was the only survivor. I should have known. Old Codger could live through anything. 
Uh, let's see. Let's con I convinced him, convinced to, return him to come to back. The Brotherhood. Well done. <laughs> it might be some time before he's fit for duty again, but we can use oh. all the help we can get. Is there anything else we need to discuss? Uh, one last thing. How are they going to talk to the holotapes? Yes, I'll take them. If we make it back, I'll see that the tapes are delivered to their next of kin. How and their memory. Will the Brotherhood remember them? They faced their mission with courage. They fought with honor against overwhelming odds. They lived and died together mm -hmm. as brothers. That is what it means <laughs> to be a member of the Brotherhood of Steel. Yeah. Oh, I personally, I love this game also. That's all. As all well right. as. I'll prepare a full report based on your investigation. If we make it back, see. I'll see that the Brotherhood honors their memory. Mm -hmm. Under the circumstances, there's not much I can offer you for your service. Mm -hmm. I hope some caps will suffice. This was no easy mission. You've earned my respect, Initiate. Well done. Yeah, I, I love uh, them both. Let's see, getting that turned in. Uh, their next two missions would send me over to Far Harbor, which I'm not going to yet. I want to go over there with Nick. Um, let's see. Yeah, I love both uh, Fallout 4 and the uh, the Elder Scrolls Skyrim. Actually, to be fair, the Elder Scrolls in general. My in my introduction to the Elder Scrolls was the uh, number four, the um, Oblivion, which was great. <laughs> Uh, yeah, my stream has mostly been, or has, for the most part, been my uh, gameplay. And if you enjoy that, awesome. If you don't, eh. I'm having fun with it, at the least. <laughs> Just trying to share some of the stuff I enjoy with others. character I've been basically going to have set aside for the streams. Man. Oh. I also have been rather amused by some of the crazy weapons that have shown up a couple times so far. Like a uh, one of those radiation guns with a uh, boost on it that gives it extra damage against super mutants even though super mutants are immune to radiation. Oh! Hello! Hello, people! Looks like I've got, uh, briefly had five people on. Oops. Can you see us down here? Hi! How y'all doing? I'm... I think this is the most viewers I've had at one time. That's awesome. Um... I'm gonna... I'm gonna thank, uh, Tropia Top Gamer, who I think may be the one who brought you over. They haven't said they have, but I'm guessing they came over from them. So, thank you. Hope you're all doing good. Ah. Uh, yeah. I've been going through, having fun, uh, I've already gone down in there, but I could, in theory, do it again. I'm trying to get, uh, better equipment here and there. And if I manage it right, I should be able to get, uh, armor that, enough armor to boost my luck by ten, eventually. It's just a little bit of the grind to get there. And, all right. There you go. You're down. Uh, you. Yes, you. Right there. There you go. Ah, uh, thrilling combat. Yep, yep, yep. Go down. Go down. Do that.
And there's someone over here. You're up there. Let's deal with you real fast. Yep, yep. Okay. Where'd you go, dude? Oh, are you over here? Oh, you're on the far side. Or, no, you're right in there. And you've got ammo. Can't forget the ammo. Ooh, come on, come on. Come on. You're walking around. You said you're on the same level. Whoa! There you are! Hello! There! Go down! Go down! There you go! Oh! Ape two balls. get this done with. Yep, yep. Now, I know I've got myself scheduled to be streaming every Tuesday. Uh, if that time slot doesn't work out, I, I can easily adjust that. I'm still adjusting to things, part of the fun. Joys of learning a twitch as I go along. And of course, if you're enjoying the gameplay, I will encourage you to uh, follow me. Yes, sir. And Proceed, join us or in, yeah, hop on when you see I'm playing. each other off. I was doing so good. You were right there. This is all much more exciting than domestic life. I see. You're gonna crawl over? Hello you. Hiding. Ah. That way you're not feeling lonely. I think I've got the key. Did I already get that magazine? I did. Okay. Just wanted to make sure. What's all this then? All right. You. You are going to let. Do not you. The door. Oh. Come on, you! Oh, I didn't have to do it that way. I was being lazy. Okay. Alright. Okay. So. Yeah, I've got... I've got my text feed open also. If you'd like to chat. Got suggestions? Eh. I'm familiar. I am familiar with the game, but hey, there's always stuff that's fun to learn to see. Good, good. Hmm. Right, 
So I will admit, I think at present my build is sort of suboptimal a little bit. Um, I am working on it. Uh, would any of you actually like to see what I have, what I've got at the present? Because. Uh, Got that guy in there probably to get. Where'd you go? Right there. I do have the key. Ah, you weren't expecting me to come from this way, were you? back up. Ooh. And let's see, can I actually follow you back? Let me, let me see. Yeah, I'll put friend request. See how that goes. Alright, so if you're curious, uh, let me take a look. Stat-wise, I've been boosting my stats here and there. Um, but... I'm doing, basically, an Intelligence 10 build. Everything was... All the other stats were at 3s. I've had to actually boost those as I level up. And I just got locksmithing to master, to master locks. But... This, I admit, is very much suboptimal at present, but I'm improving it as I go. It's not the most powerful level 28. Uh, let's see, where was my next quest, though? I've got... Well, that's a fun ha that is a fun one. Country crossings there, I've got that. I guess. And then there's that connection. Okay. Oh, I've got one more connection to basically to make. Uh-huh. Hello, Minute Men. Doing good. Yourself? Now then. Okay, I'm going to leave that bunker over there alone. For the time being. Oh! I didn't even see you there. Your growling gave you away. I didn't growl at me. You wouldn't be exploding. Well, hello there. It's, I think it's some. I think it's over this way. Because there's another settlement that I can recruit. country in the dark. Hmm. A 
Logs, I think it's called. Hmm. Yep, here we are, the slugs. And... Tighten this! Arlen, Ar uh, Hello. Hello. Huh? Oh, excuse me. Sorry. Sorry, didn't mean to ignore you. Just got caught up in my work again. So, what do you think? Nice, isn't she? Yes, she is. She's she is most definitely very nice. But are you Arlen are you Glass? The Arlen Glass, the toy designer. I am. Where did you hear that? Did you have a daughter? She died in the war. It's been a long time. Please, I don't want to talk about it. I think I have something that belongs to you. Uh, holotape? Let's see now. Go ahead. <sighs> Hi, Daddy. When are you coming home? Oh, God. Mommy. Yeah, you work too much. I want you to read me again. Mommy says you're helping all the horses find good homes. Take care of them, okay? I... I love you. And... Mm. Oh, <laughs> Buttercup says she loves you, too. We miss you. Come home soon. Oh, Marlene. I... Uh, I... Give me a minute. It's understandable. It's, it's been... been so long. I never thought I'd hear their voices again. You can't imagine what this means to me. I lost my family it's also. It's a long story, but I lost my wife and son too. Then maybe you can understand. She was right, you know. I did work too much. And now... I'll never hear her voice again. Never get to hold her. Kiss her goodnight. All I have left are the memories. And this tape has one father to another. Thank you. So what, what now? I, I can't possibly repay you for this. Here, take take everything I have. It's not much, but... And one more thing. I was saving this for her birthday. Hmm. All these years, it was all I had to remember her by. Please, I want you to have it. Ooh. Thank you. Excuse me. Make yourself at home, friend. Oh, what are you doing? Don't 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 crash on me. Don't freeze. You're freezing. Don't freeze on me. No. <sighs> Rud, it froze. 
All right. Oof. Yep. Oh, let me pause that. Oh, they've got a few things. Wow. All right, let's see. Check out <laughs> my game. I'm not sure how far. Ah. Oh, good. They have quite a few followers. That's awesome. Let me follow them back. Yep. Uh, Tropia Top Gamer. Ah, cool. Yeah, so I'm reloading my, uh, my reloading after it froze on me. Every so often, Fallout 4 will do that. It's part of the fun. Uh, I'm really hoping it hasn't frozen too far back. I don't want to have to redo all of that dialogue. Ah, looks like it's working better. Okay. Well then. Ah, they've got the showers over here. Workers. Wiseman, let's chat with him. Hey there. First, I'll turn that off. Welcome to the Slong. We're the only Tarberry bog in the Commonwealth. So, what do you think of the place? Hmm, it's, it's pretty impressive. Pretty clever, making a Tarberry bog out of an old swimming pool. Yes, quite resourceful, I must say. I appreciate your saying so. When I came across this place, it was the first time I'd seen anything like it. It seemed like a shame not to use it for something. You probably noticed it's only ghouls around here. I used to live in Diamond City, until that rat bastard mayor threw me and all the other ghouls out. I decided that we ghouls should have a place where we could feel welcome, and that's mainly why I started up this farm. Hmm, you've done rather well for yourself, Looks like then. you've done well for yourself. It's a good stand. I'm proud of all the work we've done. Still, I think we can do more. What if this place could be more than just a refuge for ghouls who aren't welcome elsewhere? What if it could also be an example of what we can do when we put our minds to something and work together? We want this to be a place that everyone looks forward to visiting, with smiling faces, good bargains, and great produce. Maybe we can make people take a second look, you know? Maybe then they'd see that we're not monsters. Hmm. I'd love Anything to help with I that. Can do to help? As a matter of fact, there is. We can't sell tarberries without traders, and trade caravans need safe roads. There's a gang of super mutants that's been preying on anyone who comes near their turf, including traders. It'd be a great help to us if you could take care of those brutes once and for all. I'll take, I'll take care, care of those super mutants. I promise. Good. I didn't know what we were going to do. Okay. 
Let's go take care of those mutant or those super mutants. We should be up this way. I'll activate that. Yep, they're just up the road. Oh. Should be good. I'm pausing here. Save this real fast. Never know what to expect. We got this Mr. Gutsy, but there's another robot that'll probably be a problem. Ooh, stalker picture. Okay. Well, we certainly don't need that anymore. Let me say that. Use this so fast. We've got a whole mass of rads we just took. Wow. Uh, Rad X, where are you? Right away. Scanning. There you are. Um, quick save. Reveal yourself. I, think I need a more powerful weapon. She's got that eye laser that will instantly kill me if I get a chance. It's coming! It's coming! The, azel, the eye laser's coming! Sultrons. Awesome robots, but terrifying. Um. Okay, that guy's ready for sun anything. I do it. Alright, alright. Mm. Moving in, moving in. He's down. down. Any part of your head right there. Oh, I got you in the head. Here. 
Come here, you. <laughs> you hit like a rat. <coughs> a rat roach. Oh, that sounds so insulting. Cosworth, you're moving. I'm trying to get your attention. Something you need, sir? Yes. I want to drop some of the stuff off with you. I'm keeping that. Oof. All right. Let's hop back over to the slogs. Almost at level 29. He's just in here. I helped him out a bit by giving him a better memory. Where are you? You're over here in the garden. Okay. Hi, Wiseman. Well, you're still alive. That either means you haven't gone after those super mutants yet, or good news? Those super mutants won't be bothering you again. I guess you are the right person for the job, huh? Thanks, friend. By the way, we've decided to support the men. We've got to help each other if we want things to get better. Excellent. All right, so what I've got to do, what have we got? First off, Skyland Drive. Oh, making that connection and then putting up some defenses. And going from there. much am I overweight? About nine pounds. All right. Yes. You, I am going to move then over. Green Top Nursery. And then have you be the connection to the slugs. Noting that I'm carrying clearly too much. Let's get this taken care of real fast. And then do the hop over to the slugs.
Well then. This is something. I guess I'm having a fight with the forged. And then what was I actually missing in order to... So, let's get a chem station set up. Because I don't think there is one. give me what I need to be able to play some defenses. Some good basic beginning defenses. Let's save that here. Cool. So, hope you have a have a good afternoon. I'm going to log off for a little bit, and I'll catch up with you later.